transfer talk, PSG aim to beat Bayern for Spurs Kane. The summer transfer window is now open in Europe, and there's plenty of gossip swirling around. Transfer talk brings you all the latest buzz on rumors, comings, goings and, of course, done deals. Paris Saint-Germain are considering an approach to sign Tottenham Hotspur striker Harry Kane, according to The Independent. The 29-year-old, who has entered the final year of his contract this summer, has recently been on the radars of Manchester United and Bayern Munich, and with the England international now open to a move in Europe. PSG are set to resurface after previously holding interest in his services. The Parc des Princes hierarchy are keen to land a star striker this summer and previously been linked with Napoli's Victor Osimhen. However, PSG are now confident that they can land Kane with the board prepared to match any offer that the Bundesliga champions put forward. Sources told ESPN earlier this week that Bayern have already made two bids to Spurs for Kane the second one worth €94 million. Euros, $103. 19M. Kane scored 30 goals in the Premier League last season, and remains 48 goals away from beating the all-time league record of 260 held by Alan Shearer. It is reported that Kane's preference would be a switch to Old Trafford. But with little progress made amid difficulty in negotiating a deal with Spurs owner Daniel Levy, the two giants of France and Germany look to be winning the race for his signature. Live Blog 13.49 BST Tottenham Hotspur goalkeeper and club captain Hugo Loris has not been included in the squad for the club's preseason tour of Australia and Asia, Spurs have confirmed. The 36-year-old has been allowed to remain at home to explore prospective transfer opportunities, the club said, while Harry Kane was among the group that set off for Perth on Friday. Loris has made 447 appearances for Spurs since joining them in 2012, during which time he captained the club to a Champions League final in 2019 having led France to World Cup glory the previous year. However, with one year left on his contract the Spurs signing Guglielmo Vicario from Empoli this summer, Loris may well have played his last game in North London. 13.04 BST, Arsenal have smashed their transfer record to complete the signing of England midfielder Declan Rice from West Ham. The club announced on Saturday. The Premier League runners-up last season agreed a fee for Rice worth £100 million plus £5 million in add-ons, sources told ESPN. The amount easily eclipses Arsenal's previous record fee the £72 million paid to sign Nicolas Pepe from Lille in 2019. When all is said and done, Rice, 24, may also become the most expensive British player in Premier League history eclipsing the £100 million Manchester City paid to sign Jack Grealish from Aston Villa two years ago. Rice's arrival follows the signing of attacking midfielder Kai Havertz from Chelsea and defender Jurian Timber from Ajax as Arsenal continue to add strength to the squad that mounted an unexpected Premier League title challenge last season. Arsenal eventually fell short to title eventual treble winners City but came out on top in the race to sign Rice. City had an earlier offer of £80 million plus £10 million in add-ons rejected. Sources told ESPN, but believed Arsenal's bid exceeded their valuation. 12.37 BST, Marseille have made Chelsea striker Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang a target this summer, according to Relivo. Aubameyang, 34, only moved to Stamford Bridge last year in a £12 million move from Barcelona, but he scored just one goal and started just five games in the Premier League since then. The Gabon international, who was born and raised in France, has plenty of experience of league football having played for Dijon, Lille, Monaco and Saint-Étienne early in his career. Aubameyang is one of several players that Chelsea are keen to move on this summer as new manager Mauricio Pochettino tries to trim down the club's overloaded squad. 11.51 BST Manchester City want to extend right-back Kyle Walker's contract by a year amid interest from Bayern Munich and Juventus. The Daily Mail reports. Sources told ESPN's Mark Ogden last month that Bayern were in talks with Walker, and that City were prepared to offload the Champions League-winning fullback. 
However, City may yet keep the 33-year-old if he agrees to the contract extension they have offered him. City are reported to want a £20 million transfer fee for the England international if he does decide to leave. The Premier League champions are also set to lose Joao Cancelo and Emerick Laporte this summer, and they could look to Bayern's Benjamin Pavard as a summer signing if they need a defensive reinforcement. 11.13 BST Former Leicester City midfielder Danny Drinkwater has said he wants to return to the club following their relegation from the Premier League and help them regain promotion. Drinkwater spent five years at Leicester City from 2012 to 17. During that time, he helped them go up to the top tier, win their fairy tale Premier League title in 2015 to 16 and reach the quarterfinals of the Champions League the following season. The 33-year-old then joined Chelsea, but his move to Stamford Bridge failed and he had four spells out on loan before being released by the club last year. Now, after a year out of the game, he wants to return to the King Power Stadium. I'd 100% go back to Leicester, it's a special place for me, he told Sky Sports News. To help them get back to the Premier League is something I'd love to do. It was hard to watch. You look at the squad and it's full of talent. They should see this as a reset. They had such a successful period before relegation, winning the FA Cup and Community Shield. If you go back 10 years, we were in the championship and then look at what the club did in the next six to seven years. They're in such a better place now than when I joined. They can get back up easily. 10.24 BST West Ham United have announced that they have agreed a British record transfer for their midfielder Declan Rice. Sources told ESPN's Rob Dawson in June that Arsenal had agreed a deal with West Ham worth £100 million plus £5 million in add-ons for Rice after Manchester City pulled out of the race to sign the England international. That fee eclipses the £100 million City paid Aston Villa to sign Jack Grealish in 2021, the current record for a player moving between two British clubs. West Ham did not mention Arsenal in their statement, nor did Rice in an open letter to the club's fans which was also published on Saturday morning. However, the 24-year-old is now set to be announced as Arsenal's third major arrival this summer. Following attacking midfielder Kai Havertz from Chelsea and defender Jurian Timber from Ajax. 9.49 BST, Arsenal announced their second big signing of the summer on Friday when versatile defender Jurian Timber joined from Ajax. Netherlands international Timber had been linked with interest from other clubs including Manchester United last summer, but, speaking after his move to the Emirates was announced. The 22-year-old explained why he had to join Arsenal. 9.00 BST, Ajax have announced that Serbian forward Dusan Tadic will leave the club immediately following his own request. The 34-year-old arrived at Ajax from Southampton at the start of the 2018-19 season. He went on to win three league titles and lifted the Dutch Cup twice. He made a total of 241 appearances for the club and found the back of the net 105 times. The decision to leave the club has been a very hard one to make. However, I believe this is the right moment, Todek said in a statement on Friday evening. I will forever be an Ajax player and hope to return to Amsterdam soon. In a different role as coach. Todek did not specify his immediate plans after leaving the club. Paper Gossip by Danny Lewis Personal terms have been agreed between Manchester City defender Kyle Walker and Bayern Munich. Reports Sky Sports Deutschland Bayern manager Thomas Tuchel is reported to be a fan of the 32-year-old, and he is now one step closer to signing him after a two-year deal with the option of a further season was agreed. The Premier League champions are said to be looking for a fee in the region of 15 million euros. Barcelona winger Rafinha remains on the radar of Al Ali, according to CBS journalist Ben Jacobs. While the 26-year-old has previously indicated his desire to remain with the Blagrana, the Saudi Pro League side still intend to pursue a move for his signature. He enjoyed bright form in the La Liga title-winning campaign last season. Contributing to 14 goals in 36 matches. 
Al Ali are also preparing to make an offer worth 25 million euros to sign Bayern Munich winger Sadio Mane, writes Ikram Koner. The Saudi Pro League side have recently been reported with interest in the 31 year old signature with optimism that they could be able to persuade him to make the switch away from the Allianz Arena this summer. As talks continue between Internazionale and Manchester United over a move for Andre Onana, the Serie A club have identified Sevilla goalkeeper Yassine Bounou as a potential replacement, according to Foot Mercado. A fee of 15 million euros could be enough to land the 32-year-old with the La Liga side looking to offload starters this summer to help ongoing financial difficulties. West Ham United have made an inquiry with Ajax Amsterdam for Mexico international midfielder Edson Alvarez, reports The Athletic. The 25-year-old, who has also been linked with Borussia Dortmund, is reported to be available for transfer this summer for a fee in the region of £40 million with the Hammers expected to submit an official proposal for him in the coming days. Thanks for your watching, don't forget to click the subscribed button and hit the bell icon for more.